Today we're going to be talking about mindfulness and why meditation is important with Kevin Wanzer, uh, the keynote speaker from MASC, on today's Think Share. Hello and welcome to the Think Share. My name is Zach Mir, bring to what I've been thinking about, sharing about, talking about, listening to, reading about that doesn't belong in math class. If you're new to the channel, I invite you to subscribe. I'm here with Kevin today and we're just having a great discussion about what has been a really integral part in his success and what he loves teaching people about and being a speaker and he, he mentioned mindfulness and meditation so I feel like it's such a hard topic to get people excited about and he said even he was resistant to it in the beginning and yeah. I know I am. What is it that it's helped you with as a speaker, as a person as, and how, why would you recommend so it? So for years I, I, I I'd had friends or you know, people that I knew that um, that meditated, and um, they're like, "Oh, Kevin, you should do this." And I tried, but with with ADHD, it just became a it, it was it was a joke. Like in my head, I just I was just laughing the whole time, thinking, "How does anyone ever silence their brain?" And I just I couldn't do it. I just and then people are like, "Oh, I do it for you know 10 minutes and 20 minutes." Like, are you kidding? There's just and then I I'm a big believer of just um, uh, you know identifying the people that you really admire. And, and successful people, and then find out what do they all have in common. And I started hearing about transcendental meditation, and it, of course, immediately you think, well, is this a, is this a following? Is this a cult? Like, what is this? And but Ellen DeGeneres and Oprah and Howard Stern and David Letterman and um, and he specifically. I mean, I used to work with him years ago, and I just know I thought, whoa, whoa, wait, wait, if he's meditating. There has to be something to this. And it was all the same thing. They were all talking about this transcendental meditation. So I checked it out. It's TM. TM.org is the website. And it's it's the best thing that's ever happened to me outside of my family. Um, it's it's like two mini vacations a day. You, do, you meditate twice a day for 20 minutes each. Um, they have, for students, you, you, you have an instructor sit down with you one-on-one -on -one for three days in a row for about an hour and a half a day where they just teach you the skills and the overall simplicity of how easy this is. There's no way to do it wrong. And the best, best way I can equate it is, um, you know, they give you a mantra that kind of just helps center, just like a, it's not a word, it's just, a couple, it's just like sounds to kind of get you focused. And then I, it's like lowering into an airplane hangar, all of a sudden you're there and it's, it's like, we're not getting weird about it, it's like paradise. Like all of a sudden, and, and whatever happens, happens. It's like, oh, I'm doing it wrong or that. No, nope, you, can't, you can't do it wrong. But after the 20 minutes, it feels like you've napped for six hours. You're so clear, you're so, any type of anxiety and, and anger and all that just seems to kind of wash not wash away necessarily, but allows you to kind of take the edges off of it, you know, where you can deal with things differently. And it's the best thing. I've been doing it for a year and a half now. And um, creatively, creatively, it it's helped amazing. And I, look, I mean, if people knew me, you'd know that there's no way this guy can meditate, but it's it's possible. And it really helps. And there's schools that have meditation times now that, that have been really, um, you know, miraculous and helpful. So if anyone's interested, you know, just go check out Transcendental, it's TM, just check out Transcendental Meditation. And there's some really cool videos on there. Jerry Seinfeld's a big advocate, and he just did a video just a couple weeks ago talking about it and the simplicity of it. And even though there's a cost to kind of work with the instructor and stuff, if you're a student, it's virtually free. Or it is free, actually, if you just apply for one of the scholarships have, they have. Have you ever used the Headspace app? Yes, yes, I have. Yep, I, yep. That's usually the one that I use 10 minutes. I think my favorite part is when it says, um, all right, now think about whatever you want to think about. Yeah, yeah. Because like the, the whole beginning part of, of it is like they're asking you to, to feel your body sensations, like acknowledge, like feel the weight of your body on the yeah. chair, um, like watch, feel and notice your breathing. And it's like your mind just keeps going off into all these other yep. spots. Mm -hmm. And I love the, yes. the analogy that Andy, I forget what his last name is, the CEO. He said, think of it like a, a road where all these cars are going by and these cars are your thoughts. And most people just get in the car and they go with a right. thought for a right. while and then they're like, oh shoot, I wasn't headed on this road. Right. And uh, the idea is that your goal is to stay on the edge and watch the cars that's and not it. get in the cars. Okay, so that's perfect. It, the point, I'm going to start using that. That's the best way to ex explain TM because you're right. It's just it's just enjoying. Not only not get in the cars, but enjoy the cars as they pass by. Yeah. That's the difference. And you see, I, I used to get frustrated by the cars. Yeah. I, I wanted like, oh, I, I, I don't didn't want, want anything on that. Right, right, there. right. But no, yeah, I just enjoy all of it because it's, it's all of who we are. But it really has been great. And so check it out and you can't go wrong. So. Thank you. Yeah, thank you for what you do. And so uh, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this, I invite you to subscribe. Hit the like button if you liked it. And Kevin? Weird stay. Wait, what is it? <laughs>